Today on Number 6 with Cheese, we're sponsored by the world's first contest marketing agency. Check them out at raven5.com. Let's go to Burger King. Woohoo! Cheddar, bacon, kings? One king, two king, I don't know. Home of the Whopper. The Whopper. Two cheddar bacon kings from Burger King acquired here in Chicago, Illinois. Jump cut! I smacked myself in the face. <laughs> Nobody cares, Sean. I want to bring up this real quick on camera. Uh, Corey doesn't know about this unless he read this comment. Somebody wrote on, like, think the Cadoba video recently. I really wish you guys would show more of the ordering process at these restaurants. Here's how it would have went here. Hi, can I get two cheddar bar bacon kings, please? One or two? Two, thanks. That's what happens. And then they were, I wish you'd show more of the food being made. Hey man, unless I'm bringing a zoom lens and just violating those people's yeah, privacy, bro. some of the places I can't film it, I feel really awkward. So, yeah, yeah dude. Uh, you, you just can't do that. That's just, just, uh. You know how when you go into a place and you order? That's what we do. It's the same thing. Can you imagine us just being like, hey, we got a comment, so we got to go back in the kitchen? Yeah. A comment? Yeah, yeah, on YouTube, excuse me, and then just climb over the counter. Son of a bitch! You made Watch them freak out. Burger King writing us a thing going, you can't go behind the counter. Yeah. What are you doing? Do so anyways, all like jokes aside, we can't always do that. You know, obviously. It needs to be predetermined. So, on with the review. We've done, just to name a few, Barbecue Bacon King. Barbecue Bacon King, cheers. Pe no. Farmhouse King. Mm -hmm. so calm down. Jalapeno King. Jalapeno King from Burger King. Cheers. Cheers. We've done damn near 10 of these King sandwiches yeah. in three years. So today, another one, cheddar instead of American cheese, and we're probably thinking a lot of it. It's a Corey Wagner second angle. All right, open it up, see what we got. Big old sesame seed bun. Open her up. And uh, wow, that's actually kind of a lot of bacon. Nice. Um, looks like mayonnaise maybe and ketchup. Um, for being the Cheddar King, kind of weak on the cheese. Just, I mean, I guess it is two slices. There's not one under there, huh? That's just such a big patty that it doesn't, Whoop. oh, yeah, there's like three or four then. All right, so four slices is good. It's a lot, it's just this, the meat is so big, it doesn't look like that much cheese to me. But I guess it is just these kings are just huge chunks of meat. Can we talk about how shocking it is that all your bacon stuck to the top bun? Yeah. How is there no bacon left besides right. little bits right here? Yeah, right? But yeah, a little bit of ketchup on there. And that's basically it. Four pieces of cheddar cheese. Is that harder to melt? Because this looks like it's trying, but I cheddar, wonder... Cheddar, I feel like when I use it home, it's normally like a little bit thicker too and yeah. denser and doesn't melt as easily. I just hope that this bacon doesn't cut this bread. Oh my God, can you imagine? <laughs> Wavy bacon? Wavy bacon? Bacon. Slice this bad boy. Dude, my bread's gotta be decimated. It's all sticking to the top <laughs> Shut of Shut up! If it's too big and kind of like uh, wavy, it'll kind of sometimes throws off like it starts to tear the bread or whatever. Like, what? What? All right, Sixers, cheddar, bacon, king, seven bucks each. Burger King, cheers. Cheers. Oh, baby. They really do have a lot of bacon on here. And the beef is so big. I love oh, this little bit. There you go. I love the flame broiled. Mm-hmm. Is it flame broiled? Or flame grilled? Grilled? Now I don't know. <laughs> flame grilled beef. I have a big ass burger, dude. This is huge. I'm not getting a, a ton of cheddar taste, but it might just be being overpowered because I'm getting a lot of bacon. I just taste the smokiness from the bun. Mm -hmm. The bun, the burger. See, like, that's got some good cheese spread in there. Sorry, you gotta look at my bites, but I'm a scientist. RIP to somebody who just ate this. <laughs> Yeah, this thing's freaking massive, dude. Mm -hmm. This is insane. Another quick shout out to the sponsor today, Raven 5, and chat with those dudes up there in Canada. Up there in Canada. I'll take two eggs side by each on a pair of toast. They just released five new white papers. Hey, 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 hey. Which in Canada, like, you don't hear marketing agencies in America call them white papers. I know, like, ebooks, probably. Of all the different ways you can do contest marketing through them to gain viewers, email addresses, just to up your brand. Oh, that's awesome. So they've been really uh, a huge fan and supporter of the show. Couldn't thank them more for sending us the shirts. When I like, I pluralized that three seconds later. <laughs> sending us the shirt. You're a boy. God, I'm getting dumber. Oh my gosh. This burger is insane. I feel like I just took six bites and I'm not even halfway done. I completely agree. That's unbelievable. This burger has to be half of your day's worth of calories. 
It's gotta be. It's gotta be over a thousand. And I feel like if you eat it, you might not need dinner. I know. If you take a late lunch, if you do like a one o'clock lunch, you might be good for the day. You're this done. Huge. I think it's funny that you can't get this in a single. No, nope. I know, right? I was thinking that when I opened, I was like, oh, a double, oh, okay. I think all their king sandwiches are always doubles. Auto doubles. We kind of talked about it in there. It's not anything super innovative with this. No. Like the farmhouse, they threw the egg on, that was cool, you know? Mm -hmm. Like the rodeo king obviously got the onion ring on it. Yeah. This is just a lot of bacon and cheddar cheese. Uh, and it really, the, my, the main thing to me that I'm really getting the takeaway from this is there's a lot of everything. There was yeah. a lot of cheese, there was a ton of bacon, and this sandwich is just freaking huge. Like, if you're really hungry, yeah. I wouldn't go for this like, oh, I want some like really huge flavor profile. No. Nope. Like some of the McDonald's fancy ones that they've done that are like really flavorful. Uh huh. I'm not getting like a huge flavor, but it's still a good burger. It's just a lot. If you're craving like an American burger, I don't think it gets better than this. Mm -hmm. If you're just like, I want that, that smoke and that cheese and bacon, this is the perfect. Perfect, perfect burger. Also, we nailed it. Want to see? Want to see something real sad, folks? 1,190 calories and 83 grams of fat. Don't eat this whole thing. Yeah, dude. I'm or not do. Even, I'm not your dad. I'm not even eating half of it. I'm gonna take one more bite. Oh my gosh, dude. That is. That's my big, my biggest takeaway. And for seven bucks. I lied. I'm gonna take one more bite again. Oh, I, dude, I, I want to, but I literally. I, I mean, I, I can't. Get it. I, I get can't. it. I get it. You're gonna have to be the bite master on this one. I'll be the BM. Guys, we got our own hot sauce. You're, sometimes people call you a big giant BM. Oh, 100 percent. Ball movement. <laughs> <laughs> Make it to the bathroom before I lose my balls all over myself. Oh. Have mercy, Lord. I will say, that's probably gonna this is probably going to be great because this is a little dry. Yeah, yeah, yeah. This is another one that could use a little extra sauce. Super good. Yeah. Yeah, dude. Oh, my God. Maybe that's the next king they need to make is like a hot a hot sauce king. The or Sixer fire, King. Fire King or something, yeah. The Sixer King. I mean, yeah. If Burger King wanted to buy a, pallet, a couple pallets of our hot sauce, that'd be awesome. It would be... Oh, my God. Can you imagine how much they'd have to buy? Oh, I mean, we would be rich. We would be rich, dude. That'd We'd go sick. from poor to rich in one day. One day, dude. That is my money. That is my money. They probably, what do you mean? They probably give us such a bad percentage. <laughs> yeah, right? Like, I feel like this is bigger than, I know the Wahlburger one was super thick. Yeah, it was taller. This feels like this is more mass total. Yeah. Like, even if you add, even though the other one was taller, this one's so much rounder. You're kind of like whatever. a Wahlburger. I'm kind of like a Burger a King. A Burger King. A little <laughs> circumference to it. Thick <laughs> boy. Beefcake. Beefcake. Yeah, yeah. yeah. For freaking seven bucks, it was five dollars cheaper, five and a half dollars cheaper than the Wall Burger. This is actually kind of a steal of a deal, like and I, I think it tastes not, better. I think yeah, it has a know, better taste to me. I like the beef taste better. Yeah. Of this, I hate to say it, than of Wall Burger. I mean, they're both insane, chains. What does it matter? Because they had all those fresh jalapenos. I don't know why that didn't have too much flavor. But. Maybe that's why these places are using all this processed flavor. It's just got more flavoring in it. Yeah. Yeah. It's probably true. Suck it up. Patreon shout out. Patreon shout out. Patreon shout out. Woo! These are the fine, fine human beings who uh, support our channel, and the best way that you can support our channel is through this Patreon. It really, 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 truly is the only way we're able to afford to be able to buy this food and, and make these videos. Um, so we like to give shout-outs to everybody who donates and supports the channel, so that's what we're gonna do. I'm game. Could really go for a Diet Coke right now. Patreon shout-out name number one. Oh boy, Corey Wagner. Yeah, we've already kind of given this guy a shout-out, but he deserves like a, a this is his actual shout. Like we mentioned him in a video before, yeah. like, but this is we gotta give the actual shout-out. This is his second time doing this. Mr. Rob G 250 bucks a month to the number six with cheese show. Absolutely. We've only not. had two or three people in the history of the show ever give that much. Oh, yeah. Rob, we've met with him before. He loves the show. We've had beers with him. We gotta go get beers with him again we've soon. We've talked strategy sure. of the show. He just like, he gave us a bunch of good recommendations for food. Oh my God, his food recs were. Yeah. Uh, Doghouse was one of the ones that we had. Yeah, really dude. So Rob, thank you so, so much. Even when he bumped down, he went still to be the most uh, donated, like to 30 or whatever it yeah. was, and then back up to 250. Rob, you're the man. You are the freaking man. We'll get beers soon. Soon, my friend. Yeah, all the green lines are on us. Or I guess your 250 would pay for it. <laughs> yeah, technically, <laughs> on us, on you. This is actually <laughs> genius. Let it ride! And our second Patreon shout-out goes to AJ McCoo! Um, dude, every dollar counts. Don't, don't, 
Don't feel like less of a man for this. That five dollar tier is still a oh, boss. I boss am not move, at dude. all making you feel like you're less of a man, dude. Because that five bucks every month adds up, and enough of you guys do that. Maybe one day, you know, maybe Strength we'll be able to numbers, afford man. rent. Dude, I wish, man. <laughs> Patreon.com forward slash number six with cheese. Donate, and don't forget, if you donate $25 a month, you get a t-shirt for free. 30 bucks, you get to pick where we go. A lot of fun stuff. Yeah. Thank you. All right, Burger King lovers or Burger King haters, lovers and friends. Out of five, who's your favorite cartoon mouse? Cartoon mouse? I can only think of Mickey. Out of five, Mickey Mouses. How many Mickey Mouses do you give the cheddar? Bacon King from Burger King, $7, Corey. Man, this was really good. Like I, I said this during the video, obviously. It's not the best flavor profile of any sandwich I've gotten, but pound for, like, the ma the amount that I get, it's still a great burger. Yeah. Like you said, it's still a your, your good American burger. Mm -hmm. The amount that you get with all that bacon, they did not slouch on the bacon, they didn't slouch on the cheddar, with it only being, like, seven bucks, this is actually, like, a really good steal of a deal, in my opinion. I'm gonna go with a 4.25. Very, very highly recommended. Yeah, I think this was one of the, like the filler ones before they come out with a more innovative King sandwich. They kind of seem to like ping pong where they'll do like a bunch of new ingredients on one and then kind of put one out with stuff they already have. Yeah. I think it's a very smart money, penny to penny idea. Uh, still a great taste. I won't get that again, but I'll be excited for the next King sandwich. I'll tell you that. Also, somebody who eats one of those and fries in a drink, oh my gosh. there's no way you're doing anything else that day. Oh now, you're gosh. not being as productive as you could be. No way. You're not going to the gym. No, you'll be tired. 3.75. I'm always excited when they put these out. I hope they do a habanero king. That's mm. that's the one I'm holding out for. And then of course I hope they do the Reaper King. Yeah, because I'd of love course to the see Sixer King would be. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh, guys, thank you so much for watching. Four videos this week. Another one tomorrow. Brew and review. Back in the kitchen, cooking something up, drinking some brews. We'll see you guys tomorrow. Thanks for rocking with us every single day. And here's what the hot sauce looks like. Uh, it's gonna take over the world if you want it. That's on our website at number six Bye, L Rob. Seriously, AJ, we love you.